as you as promised here is my voltage regulator control box so I'm gonna explain to you in one minute how this works as you can see it looks very intimidating but it's actually very straightforward and this is the other side just some LCD display voltage display and some lights Okay, so how it works is um, AC voltage from a turbine comes in here, then it travels to this thing. It's called a voltage window compensator, something like that. You can see it's adjustable for voltage, and this plugs in just here. Okay. Anyway, when the voltage is below 230, it doesn't switch on. It's like an automatic switch. So basically what happens is, when my charger is running, it drops the voltage to 215. And uh, that, that charger can handle from 180 to 240 volts. So from now on, when it starts to flow the batteries, it uses... Its 10% of the amount of power that they have used in. So then the voltage climb at 230 volts, this switch on and lets the power travel through here to this light demonstration. You can see it turns and from then it regulates the amps to this heating element and a normal 12 volt AC fan from a transformer. Showing schematic. Okay, AC turbine volts in here, travels from there to window compensator, and from there on travels to a uh, light demo switch and from there travels to straight to the, to the element. So why I'm using the light demo switch is because um, I think it's about 1 kilowatt elements but uh, my turbine can only give 500 watts. So when I see when it when it it turns on the component and I would like to adjust the um, voltage given through or the current through the element so I can adjust the voltage perfectly to 230 volts and when the charger switch back on this will switch off so as you can see it's actually very straightforward I don't think it's, you can call it a charge controller it's just a basically a voltage regulator I'm going to install it now and show you guys quickly how it works.